Hi there, I'm Jules from thestonesoup.com and today I've got another fresh six ingredient dinner recipe for you. Okay, I've got four medium zucchini that I've just sliced up and I've just popped them in a, a baking tray with a drizzle of olive oil and I'm going to pop them in the oven. So hot oven, 250C, which is about 480F. Uh, for about 20 minutes to get them to start softening and browning. Okay, so zucchini's been in for 20 minutes and it's a little bit more burnt than I would have, or browned, <laughs> well browned we'll call it. Um, but yeah, it's looking nice and soft, so it's good to just give it a quick stir. Just move any bits from the corner so they don't burn when we put them back in the oven. This my oven was hotter than I thought. Anyway, that's all good. So I'm going to get some almond meal in, so 100 grams, which is uh, about three and a half ounces. And the almond meal, like it looks like a lot, but it's actually kind of, you know, in egg pom pom pajama when they do the bread crummy thing, it gives you that kind of bread crummy vibe and makes it a lot more substantial. So we'll just stir it in a little bit, but not too much. Then next we've got our tomato passata, so just going to spoon that over, kind of dollop it on, just half a cup. You could use crushed tomatoes if you want to. And then we've got some bocconcini, I've got using small ones, so I'm just going to use the whole pack here, so it's 200 grams I think, which is 7 ounces. You could use larger ones and tear them into chunks if you like. And these just melt down and make it like so cheesy and gooey and, <laughs> and all those good good things and then I'm going to finish up with some parmesan so I've just got um, that's like 50 grams so a couple of ounces grated parmesan okay and then back in the oven for another five to ten minutes okay our zucchini parm done it looks like it's ready the it's all bubbling and golden and the cheese is melted you could put it in for a little bit longer if you want but I'm happy with that So if you enjoyed this, really encourage you to head on over to my blog, it's thestonesoup.com and you can download a free ebook filled with beautiful, fresh, six ingredient dinner recipes just like this one.